So first down for UC Davis at the 12 of Tulsa. Rodriguez to the end zone. It's tipped and it's caught. Touchdown Aggies, McAllen Castles. And Gomez knocks it through on third and four. Bryn fires, caught by Stokes, lost the football in the end zone. A mad dash for it. Out of bounds. And a touchback. UC Davis takes over. Disaster for Tulsa. A much cleaner game. Simply a stunner in the season opener here at Chapman Stadium. Again, it's Merritt, and he's in. Touchdown, Eagles. First and ten. Barrier. Caught. Touchdown, Eagles. Great job, Barrier by his eyes. Looking to the left, comes back to the right. Barrier with time. Throws, it's tipped and caught. Two-point conversion is good. Broomfield, pressure coming. He's going to step up, take off and run. Inside the five, cuts it back, touchdown Rebels. To tie it, Broomfield to throw. Easter Washington, same game over. I believe he caught it, but he was just shy and let the celebration begin. The Eagles have come to Allegiant Stadium and claimed victory. But was injured in the FCS championship game and he's not available. Straight up the gut, this is Strong! Strong's got a chance! Strong! Touchdown! South Dakota State! Here's Strong! Strong! Touchdown! Jack Rabbits have done it again! Last two years, Mark Gronowski won't play this year with the knee. So Olaf Doken getting an opportunity and shining. And shining some more! It's another touchdown! Jaden Yonke! Football championship subdivision back in May to Sam Houston. And they're taking up some frustration right now. Easy touchdown, Isaiah Davis. To the FCS National Championship. Oladoka only playing because Mark Gronowski and Dennis Lane was injured in the FCS Championship game. Oladokun rushing touchdown, no problem at all. They win a ball game against an FBS team for just the second time in school history. Congratulations to John Stigelmeyer and South Dakota State. Square and he knew he was about to get smoked. Answer rolling out. Pressure comes deflected and intercepted by Holy Cross. Jason Modak in the right spot at the right time and rumbling down for the touchdown. And the Crusaders with the pick six and the score. Sluka, I think, has got to pull one of those. Downfield, catch is made into the end zone. Ayer Asante, another Jersey guy with the score. Because we're going to play up and not get any hand on him. We're giving him a free release. It's just running past you. Take the get to the end zone. High pass, touchdown for the 14. Up the middle, Purdy bumped, pushing. Did he get in? Waiting for the signal. Touchdown. The Holy Cross Crusaders over FBS Connecticut. Here's the 10th play of that drive. Quarterback keeps it. Humphrey has put Montana in front. And he extends the Montana lead to six. Three to his left, one to his right. Dylan Morris back to throw. Well protected. Delivers. Picked. Intercepted at the 30. What a gutsy performance by Cam Humphrey. Can't stress that enough. He grew up in Issaquah, Washington, around Husky faithful all the time to come into their stadium and shock them. To the air. End zone. Touchdown. And Devin Body, who we haven't 
see much of it all tonight. Whoa, the ball slips out of the hand of Seals. Scooped up by the Buccaneers. Here comes the return by Scott and a touchdown. The first SEC team to lose to an FCC, FCS opponent in five years. And that guy knows a thing or two about the SEC. Randy Sanders, long time. Defensive backs have to be Velcro to these receivers. They've got to take a stand here. Parentes over the middle. Isabella. Touchdown, Duquesne. The touchdown and a two-point conversion. Here we go. Rourke to the end zone. It's caught. Touchdown, Tyler Walton. Four receivers to the right. On the two-point conversion, they go to Lorman, the tight end, oh. and he can't pull it in. Oh. The oh, coverage. Been here in this conference, he is going to be somebody to watch. Final score 28 26 Duquesne. I'll employ a tight end to the left. Snap to Cooper. Give is Samuel. He'll break to the left and score. Josh Samuel. Oh, yeah, pretty, I don't okay. know if it's, you know. Here's Cooper launching wide open touchdown. Ahmad Edwards. Here's Cooper, four-man rush for Florida State, going to cut it loose. Phil Yaw Johnson caught it inside the 10. Phil Yaw Johnson on his feet. He'll cut back, and Jacksonville State has won at the horn. On the final play of the game, Zarek Cooper Throws to DeMond Philyaw Johnson, and the Gamecocks have upset the Seminoles. Just went back and forth with a touchdown that gave him a 42 31 lead with under three minutes to go on a one yard touchdown pass from Cameron Ward to Taylor Grimes. The Bobcats then kicked a 37 yard field goal with just under a minute left to make it a one score game. But the Cardinals held on 42 34 to improve to 2 and 1. Martinez will go under center. Daniels right behind him. They'll give him the handoff. He's got the first down. Bounces it to the outside. Touchdown. To the end zone and a touchdown for Northern Arizona. <laughs> Little play action. Kempton the tight end. The fire to the end zone and the pass is caught. Coleman Owen hauls it in for the touchdown. There's McLeod from the shotgun looking to his left. Throws it up. Barry Hill. Touchdown. It is caught. Curry's got his Curry. second touchdown of the night. Anderson in the backfield, flanking McLeod, who operates from the shotgun, under pressure, gets rid of the ball, and it is incomplete. Against a Pac-12 team and stunned Arizona, 74 players from the state of Arizona. Holmes, Josh Atwood, the freshman, has checked in. Here's Kasim Hill. He'll take it. Hill walks into the end zone. Touchdown, Rhode Island. <laughs> Glad to have you back. Here we go from the five over the middle. It is caught. Touchdown, Rhode Island, Ed Lee. Hill lofts it and zone. That's a touchdown. Touchdown for the big man, Kenny. Kill the clock, turn around, punt fourth quarter. 70 yards of penalties today for Rhode Island and nope not the case here's Smith first down and more cuts upfield to the 30 there he goes at the 20 10 5 to the end zone touchdown Rhode Island 72 yards for the freshman Jalen Smith holy cow what a run comes into McGurk in the old Yankee conference rivalry will have the scales tip back in favor of the fellows from Kinston. The team, man in motion here for Maine, second and 18. They'll keep it on the ground to Brock. Brock's got room, Brock's got daylight, and it's a touchdown for Freddie Brock from 18 yards out. He's in last year, two already this season. To the end zone, Fagnano, one-on-one -on -one coverage, and it is caught. Complete young touchdown, Maine. Play action here for Fagnano over the middle and into the end zone. Touchdown. Moss in motion. The give. Looking for an edge and he stretches over the goal line. Touchdown. Watching. That just made my day. Oh, Here's man. Barnwell. Touchdown. End zone. Touchdown. 
And Maine. Elijah Barnwell, the ball carrier. Just lighting it up here against the Minutemen.